Hi, my name is Rosa Yala, and I'm a student at San Jacinto College North. I'm an only child, and I live with my parents. And no, I don't get spoiled. I'm your average 18 year old. I grew up in a society that following the crowd is the only way to be accepted. When I was in junior high, that's when all the trends and people start matur maturing were starting out. Um, and I was bullied and picked on because I was different. Because I didn't want to follow what everyone else was doing. That year in junior high was the worst year of my life. It was so hard to cope with everything. I didn't know what else to do. But later on, I learned that it was okay to be different. It was okay for me to be for who I am and not to follow what everyone else was doing. There are many interpretations about the poem. He talks about two different roads, one that everyone uses and one that hardly anybody uses. To me, what that represents is how society is nowadays. The one road that everyone uses that's all worn out, that makes me think of how society is, that's all the people following the newest trends, pretty much. And the other roads that hardly anybody uses are the people who want to be different, like me. I don't like following the crowd. I don't like following trends. It's, there's no point in me doing that. It's better to be different. You're not special anymore if you just end up being like everyone else. That's how, to pretty much sum it up, but that's, that's how I can compare myself with the poem. And that's why I picked it. The Road Not Taken by Robert Frost. Two roads diverged in a yellow wood, and sorry, I could not travel both. And be one traveler, long I stood, and looked down one as far as I could, to where it bent in the undergrowth. Then took the other, just as fair, and having perhaps the better claim, because it was grassy and wanted wear. Though as for the passing there, had warned them really about the same, and both that morning equally lay, in leaves no steps had trotted black. Oh, I marked the first for another day. Yet knowing how may leads on to way, I doubt if I should ever come back. I should be telling this with a sigh. Somewhere, ages and ages hence, two roads diverged in a wood, and I, I took the one less traveled by, and that has made all the difference.